Tonight we have the wonderful Island Kim here, uh, who will be playing uh, traditional Korean music on the Taegu, which is a traditional, unusual bamboo flute from Korea. Um, Island Kim will also be explaining to us how the Taegu has been recontextualized um, in an increasingly diverse world. She also has two supporting musicians, Mark and Yi Jin Hyung, I hope I pronounced that correctly, who will be supporting her. So please join me in welcoming Hanan Kim. Of the Shilla Kingdom heard that a floating island in the eastern sea was approaching the common temple which he had erected. Being curious, the king asked his astrologer about the island and was told it was a valuable gift from the king's father, King Mumu, who had been reborn as a great dragon in the sea. After investigation into the island, the servant reported that there were two bamboo stems that separated in daytime and fused into one at night. When the king went to see the bamboo tree, the dragon appeared and said to him that the bamboo only produces sound when both, both sides come together. The entire world will be peaceful if you make a flute out of the deep bamboo. After that, the king ordered the plant to be cut and flute made out of the mystical bamboo. The sound of the flute had the power to repulse attacks by foreigners, to attract rain during droughts, and to heal illnesses. Acknowledged as a secret flute, it was named as Mampashita, the flute to suit 10,000 ways.
been performing Korean tradition in more than five, uh, more than ten years actually. I've just submitted my PhD on contemporary aspects of Korean tradition music at the University of London, so as, <coughs> as an ethnomusicologist. First of all, I'd like to uh, say that I'm so happy to be at the Asia House and uh, to see this ambitious and enthusiastic audience <laughs> bringing your own culture to share. And um, today, I'm going to uh, add it to that. Uh, today, I'm going to introduce the beauty of uh, Korean tradition music. Korea is an East Asian country neighbored by China to the west and Japan to the west east. Today, Korea is the world's 12th largest economy and has a significant regional power in East Asia. <coughs> Among those aspects, Korean culture is known for its long history and extraordinary aesthetics and uniqueness. The significance of Korean traditional music has been acknowledged internationally, and eight of the music-related treasures have been appointed <coughs> by UNESCO as World Intangible Heritages. Now, I will illustrate the brief history of the Korean traditional music.
flow. The music represents the ideal concept of the world, which is uh, divided into two extremes, yin and yang. Yin is winter, female, dark. Yang is summer, male, bright. Following the yin and yang principle, the instruments for the court music are made of eight natural materials, silk, bamboo, wood, stone, metal, clay, board, and hide. They accomplish the ideology all together. Can you recognize which of the eight materials this flute is made of? <laughs> <laughs> this is so obvious. It's made of bamboo. Um, the tegu, this is called the tegu. This is horizontal bamboo flute in Korea. It's one of the most representative um, uh, Korean traditional instruments. This has a big, really big onwushu, which creates very expressive vibrato. Just next to the onwushu, there is an oval shaped hole covered by memory. Memory is from the uh, inner part of the reed. If I overlook, if I play, play plainly, it sounds uh, normal, but if I overlook it, it creates a very unique buzzing sound. I love this. <laughs> And the piece I'm going to play is one, the, one of the popular solo pieces for the Degen. What I'm going to play falls into another genre of court music. The one I've explained, played before, is the music played in the court of the royal family. This piece is played as a way of entertaining of aristocratic people in Joseon dynasty. Let me just briefly explain about this majority music before I play it. Pungyu is the term referring to the chamber music of the majority music. Pung uh, means wind and ryu means stream, and the world describes the mind state and attitude to perceive the artistic qualities of this work. I hope you can feel the flow of the wind and stream while I'm playing it. play a little short excerpt of the piece.
which has a shorter body, which in, uh, uh, provides a more vivid, more expressive, vivid, uh, brighter color of timbre, tone color. <coughs> um, so, go away. <laughs> As you, uh, I'm just to play a little bit of folk music for your understanding.
work and entertainment. The folk bands consist of drumming, drumming, dancing, and singing, and it is called full moon. During the full moon, first full moon of Lunar New Year, bands in many Korean villages marched from house to house to exercise demons, demons, and often to collect funds for village project. Based on Pung let's see what Pung means.
Roger Tengu, and he also is very interested in ancient music.
Thank mm-hmm. you.